Ah. Oh, there's a big old rat right there. A what? Big old rat. A rat. <laughs> yeah, he just came out of his hole and went <laughs> somewhere else. <laughs> it made me jump. So ever since I used the box blade on this road and flattened it out, it has dried out really, really nice, which I'm really glad about that. But of course, of course, it's going to rain. It's going to rain again tomorrow. So actually, I think it's going to rain for like five days straight or something like that. A guy just can't get a break. So this is really cool to see. I just noticed this walking through here. Now, I, maybe one of you guys can let me know what kind of flowers these are because if you've watched Sidestep Adventures or, you know, even this series, I think I call everything like a lily or daffodil, even if that's not what it is. But this is really cool since we've got all this overgrowth cleared away because at the beginning of this year, you, you couldn't even walk through here. It was completely covered over. But now that I've got all that away, these old planted flowers are coming back up. And I think that's really cool to see. That's all I had, hey? Yeah, right there as well. Hey there. What well, order that was? Some kind of fan or something. So the goal today is to try to clear some of this out and be able to actually close this place up and lock it up. Yeah. So I guess I'll just... I can't need a floor put in it too. Oh, it needs a floor put in it, definitely. Yeah, because it's so good. Yeah, it's, it's dirt down there. The ah. floor has all just disappeared and rotted yeah. away. I only found a few pieces of it. This is pretty interesting. You see it, a date on it? 1979. Oh. <laughs> President Carter begins critical talks on Mideast peace. Huh, I think we're still talking about that today. <clears throat> Alright, so first things first, obviously that stuff needs to be moved so I can close the door. And then we'll just work our way in. And there's, a, there's actually a lot of good stuff in here. That's that roll a dust guard. A dust gun, so like dusting crops or a garden or something? Mm -hmm. Oh, that guy. Oh, that's that guy. I had to rust it out. Yeah. Oh, look. What's that? Waffle iron for Armstrong table stove. You're making your making your waffles on an Armstrong table stove. That's neat. Set that right there. Old newspaper. More old newspaper. That's not even that paper I got away. Look at two thousand dollars worth of Captain America comic books. Ah, hey, look! I can jack up the foundation of the house with this one. <laughs> not really. Oh look, a silverfish. Silverfish eating newspapers. Interesting little critters there. We'll let them have their lunch. Hey, look, we do have some floor in here a little bit. Not that, but some kind of replacement floor. Yeah. We'll just toss it all out.
Interesting. Door closing. Oh, what in the 1940s stroller is this? Let me check that out. An old, pretty old baby stroller, I think. That's pretty neat. Check this out right here. I might just swap my GoPro for one of these. An old Kodak Brownie holiday camera. An old camera. Yeah. There you go, Ken. I'm gonna take some pictures. Uh, you can be my second photographer. <laughs> You're hired. You got the job. Uh, oh yeah, that, that was a blow up. I want this old brawler. Yeah, let's have Yeah, there you go. <laughs> you should take it home and ah. you should take it home and get it to work again. Ah. Bring it back for our ah. summer ventilation here once you get it to work. Ah. I don't know if I care a lot. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Spell how old it is. Yeah. That little, oh, there's still four right there. Oh, look, another one of these. I found one of these in the old bottle dump a while back. And there's another one out here in the canning shed. Look at that glistening. That's awesome. Ew. Ew. That's gross. Just knew that might happen. Oh, yeah. Nothing. Nothing. This table has seen better days. Nothing exciting up there, but I do see something that intrigues me. Apparently somebody knew I'd be working on this house one day and put one of the trim pieces for the Old Bird Farmhouse over there in that corner. That's what that is too. I wonder when that came off of the house. That's cool. It's always good to find pieces of the Old Bird House laying around. Man, this is in here pretty good. Is it right holding one of these walls up, is it? We'll find out. This is. Oh, is it What's holding it back there? Oh, no way. Oh. Oh, I found an old wagon. Yeah. yeah, this is part of an old wagon right oh, here. Oh, yeah. What I've cut it about. I've used a horse I used to pull. Yeah. Oh. Oh, that is too cool. Let's take it outside and look at it a little bit better. So this is definitely a really cool piece of the farming history of the old bird farm. 
amazed. It's amazing I'm still making discoveries like in that shed. I thought I looked at it pretty good. Obviously not. Uh, I wonder when this dates back to. This is pretty cool though. It's got some M1101 is written on that right there. And on this side, this is the same thing, M1101, but this is a cool piece right here. Definitely, definitely a cool piece of the farming history of the old farm. And for it to still be here in mostly intact shape, that's awesome. See, I guess this is where it would attach to uh, to a wagon or something, and like a tongue, and you connect your horses up there. Maybe I'm not exactly sure. Ken, you were you were, you were alive when people were using these things. How did this work? I don't know. I don't know if I was thinking of that car. Oh man, I thought you were older than that. <laughs> <laughs> so what kind of critter? Chewed through this chair right here. Maybe that's just rot. I guess that's just rot. Rot, maybe termites. But it's. Ooh, look at how the wood just turns to powder. It's like when I was working on that porch that time and uh, kept having that powdery remains of wood raining down in my face. Alright, I gotta get some more stuff out of here so we got room. That means you. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, no. Yeah, you can probably make another leg for it. Yeah. I ain't gonna throw it away. Yeah. I think it's cool. I like old stuff like this. I get got another piece of wood. Cut out of that whole piece. Yeah. You said you could do that? I don't know if I could. I get you could. He's volunteering to do <laughs> it. <laughs> hey, you ever seen? You ever seen one of these before? I know you've seen one of these before. I said, have you ever seen one of these before? And then I said, I know you've seen one. Of these yeah, old iron did. Oh, I didn't say that one. Little can opener for Yeah. Me. Audio can, I believe. <laughs> That's it? Yeah. Here you go. Don't say I never gave you anything. Ah. I said, here you go. Don't say I never gave you anything. Ah, okay. I don't know if I can get it to work or not. You probably can. You just need some WD 40. Yeah. And <laughs> prayer. That wheel's full of turn, I think it got some like brass stuff. Yeah. They might have sprayed his foot spray with that. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Alright. Well Ken, I appreciate uh, your company today. Yeah. <laughs>